for a very, very long time, but I am back and better than ever. I missed you all so much. I've already had DMs and comments about what y'all want to see, so I'm here to deliver. Allen Bar and Grill dropped the new cooking system, and many of y'all think that it involves a hood, and it really, really doesn't. So I got some of the recipes scrolling to my left, but this is the ABG Fresh Box. It contains all the ingredients I need for the recipe, so I don't have to go to the grocery store, but you can. Super role play friendly. Let's get into it. So normally I go grocery shopping, but today I'm using the ABG Fresh Box. But this is some of the essentials that you need when cooking any of the recipe, any recipes on their website. The preparation kit, it got all the prep stuff. You definitely need the water filter. Don't forget the cups and the cookware, all your pots and pans that you need. So without grocery shopping, these are all the ingredients that were inside of the, the ABG Fresh Box. And now I'm going to res them out. With all the contents rezzed out, this is all that was in the ABG Fresh Box. It even came with a cute little recipe card right here in my hand. I prefer to use my phone to the left of the screen so you'll be seeing it pop in and out. It's just easier for me to look at. Okay, I got my small skillet out from my cookware set. And then there goes my phone in the corner of the screen. We're going to scramble eggs to start. So make note, sometimes when you click these items to res them out, because I think it says I need two eggs on a recipe, some of them spawn out. Others will give it to you on your inventory and you just have to res it out. So, but these eggs are spawning out. So I'm just going to drag them closer to my ABG skillet right here because I'll show you in a second. When you start cooking, the skillet scans for the items. So you just need to make sure they're close. So here's the salt. With the salt, you see it's going to give it to me in my inventory. I'm going to press keep and it's going to put it in my inventory and I'm just going to res it out. And there it is, rezzed out. There goes my handy dandy prim. I tried to keep it from y'all as long as I could, but I suggest everybody use a prim so that way you're not losing none of these items. Because I think when you res them, I don't know if they come back in your inventory if you was to lose them. So I'm just following the recipe, um, resing out everything. Those are the scallions um, and dragging them closer to the pan because the pan is going to pick up everything it needs all the ingredients now that i have all my ingredients out i'm going to click the pan when you click the pan you press start recipe you're going to search for the recipe that you are doing i'm doing scrambled eggs so i found it i'm going to click it and then like i said before the pan is going to scan the area also it's emoting in the chat but i kind of cut that out in the corner of the screen but all the ingredients are going to pop up I just keep pressing one because it just shuffles all the way through. Also, key point, make sure you have all of your ingredients rezzed out before you start putting it to the pan. Because if you don't have it out and you read, put everything in a pan already, you can't make the pan go back to add something that you forgot. So just make sure everything is rezzed out near the pan according to the recipe. So I'm going to finish adding everything to the pan. As you'll see, it can, it's going to keep popping up on its own. You don't have to keep clicking the pan. It's going to keep popping up on its own until all the ingredients are gone. And I'm just going to do the scallion. And then it's going to pop up on its own. I'm not pushing anything. After I click the ingredients to go in, now it's going to say start frying. So that means that I had all the ingredients. If it doesn't pop up and say start frying, that means you missed something. Also... Y'all don't have to get this, but I, y'all know I role play. I like the look of everything. This is the ABG mat. They have it in the, in the store as well. It has a whole bunch of cooking animations that you could just, it comes with sounds. It comes with the props. It got it all for anything around the kitchen. So I prefer it. I use it. So this stuff cooks an actual, whatever time it says, that's the time it's going to take. So those are cooking down and while those are cooking down i'm gonna start cooking well frying the bacon so i'm starting to bacon while the eggs are still scrambling if you cook everything one by one it's gonna take you all day so if you can try to start the others while the other stuff is cooking sometimes you can't do that because you need something from the first recipe to put into the second recipe so make sure whatever you cook in you don't need something from the first one to start because you you can't go back if you don't add it you know so 
right now i'm adding bacon i think it called for three strips of bacon i'm dragging it in the pan but you do not have to do that that is the large pan in the cookware set um now i wanted to point out this butter the recipe called for butter you see i'm clicking the butter nothing is happening i'm like okay what's going on here but when you cook when basically when you click to cook which i'm doing now um i'm going to find frying bacon in the recipe i done clicked the large pan so this is what's going on and i'm gonna find it when you find it it's gonna pop up so i guess the butter is one of them things where it doesn't spawn nothing or it doesn't give you anything it just needs to be around so just bear in mind so i started frying the bacon the eggs are still scrambling and I'm just going to let everything cook on down. So now I'm going to press fry. I don't know why that last piece of bacon didn't um, disappear. I don't know if it was like a glitch or if it didn't take the bacon, but whatever. So now I'm resin out the chopping board. You see that the scrambled eggs just gave me the finished product. So now I'm going to make room for the chopping board. Um, I'm going to whip out my phone for the chopped onion recipe. There it is. So I'm just it's spawning the slices of onion. So I'm just going to drag them onto the chopping board you don't have to chop you don't have to do anything no animations is going to cook on its own but you know me so now i'm still chopping the onions and i think i pushed that is the prep board from the prep kit i pushed the prep board to start um the actual chopping of the onion process so that's what's happening i'm putting the sliced onions basically into the prep board to chop just like i've been doing everything else Okay, really quick disclaimer here. When you're cooking anything, if you notice at the very last minute that you forgot to add something, make sure you res it out before you click to add the very last ingredient into the appliance. That's the only thing that can save you because you cannot go back. So now I added all of the sliced onion to the prep board. It popped up and said chop. That means that I had enough ingredients out and present. So I'm going to chop. Okay, after all of the skillets gave me my final product, I got my phone in the corner of the screen. I grabbed two shells from that box and then I have the prep tray because that's the appliance that this recipe said I needed. So I'm going to add, I'll click the prep tray and I'm going to look for breakfast tacos because that's what we're making today. Uh, I don't even know if I mentioned that this whole video. I am so sorry. We're making breakfast tacos. <laughs> um, but now I'm adding all of the ingredients to the prep tray and we're gonna basically the same thing that we've been doing this whole process pressing one and one and one all over just to add everything in Once it's done, it said it's taking a minute to cook, so I'm going to give it some time to cook. And boom, you have the finished product. It came with a little cute little open and close aluminum tray for freshness, but this is the final product. Mm, okay, get closer. I'm giving y'all a little bit of ASMR greatness right now. I'm getting to this breakfast taco. Papa wants something so bad. Mm -mm. Get into it. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I had to finish that taco. I've waited too long. But that's how you cook with the ABG cooking system. So it's no HUD needed. Um, 
I really love the system as a whole. It's a bit of a tedious process. You're going to take some time in it and, and it actually emotes in the chat. So if you love role play, you love being busy in the kitchen, this is the perfect cooking system for you. Um, I'm back and better than ever. So if y'all need any videos, let me know. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment what you want me to cook next down below. See y'all.